Hello and welcome to the Al Bayt Stadium here in the northern Qatari city of Al Khor. I'm Derek Ray and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And it's second time around in the group stage for these two teams. It's Portugal versus the Korea Republic. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides did OK in their opening matches, but lose today and they will be in trouble. This will be an interesting game, I think. Rafael Leao. Really good challenge. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Jung Woo Young. Huang Ui Jo. Huang Hee Chan. Congratulations to today's lucky fan of the match, Travis Holstein. Please come to guest relations to claim out. your prize. Oh, nice work to get past his opponent. Good defending in the end, and danger averted for now. Huang Ui Jo. That's useful play. In the opinion of the referee, that is a penalty. Jung Min Son and confidently converted. So underway again Korea, here, one nil the score. Seven, Min Sun. Huang Ui Jo. Bruno Fernandes. Considerable momentum, courtesy of Ronaldo. But what can he produce from here? Well, there to intercept. It is a decent looking attack here. But the danger averted for now. Perfect example of how to put in a tackle. And a corner will be next. Illegal play and hence a free kick. Fernandes. So almost at the break here. And not quite going to plan for the home side. Work to do, Stewart. Well, they've not had quite enough purpose to their attacking play so far. It's all been a bit too predictable. But in the second half, if they can get more support to their strikers and play with greater intensity, they can certainly turn this around. The first official has indicated He's looking for the right moment for that final pass. Keeping the ball moving, but then the one that goes astray. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Coming up half time, there will be a display from the police dog display team. So stay in your seats for that. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. And Portugal moving the ball with purpose. Big chance to get them on terms. And clears the danger. Guerrero, Ronaldo, and it's teed up for Ronaldo, it's got to be, and the keeper caught there. Well, you have to categorise that as a missed opportunity. Jung Woo Young, well, he's given us away. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Kim. Surely. Oh, and a goal. And you've got to say, they definitely took a reflection off the defender. Well, here's the replay, and there's an obvious deflection. Certainly enough to beat the keeper. He got a bit lucky there. Time for a change then. Goal and the ball is moving Korea, again. 2-0 is how it stands. 
playing Yui Joe. 20 minutes to go in this one. And support available. Went in strongly, decisively. Running a chance to eat into their lead. Really digging in. A goal! Just what they needed. Still plenty of life in this match. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. But there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's goal! just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plot. It's a great goal. Number 11. So back underway. And let's see. Can Portugal find another one? Just 10 minutes to go. Jung Woo Young, Huang In Byung. Good use of the ball, but can they trouble the defence? Can he finish them off? But he took care of it defensively. Now, who can he play it to? But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. And the referee makes it official. Well, this hasn't gone Portugal's way. Not at all what they have in mind. Stuart, sum it up for us. Well, Derek, it was a hard fought contest, which neither side completely dominated, but the result will certainly hurt them. They need to bounce back next time out.